as the economy grew and particularly as its productive capacity grew and it developed technologically, it led to a system in which what could be produced was in fact adequate for all to share, in which misery and poverty was no longer necessary, in which in a sense a utopia was possible. My view of the future of the Occupy movement and the Right to the City movement both is, is that, they, that it lies very much in the ability to formulate transformative demands that move in the direction of revolutionary demands but are not themselves revolutionary. We will see it as, to a large extent, up to us up to you, up to those in, in these movements to see what it is. That's where we are.